Oh. It's a goddamn bathtub, Jen. Man's fiance leaves him for another bloke, and at least you would think that maybe he could go get some decent liquor. Sam Joel, expert salesman. <laughs> Look at me. I couldn't afford a ring. A jack? Oh. Jack could afford a ring. He could afford a ring for everything. I thought you'd give me something top shelf. Hmm. Hmm. That's what I'm talking about. You know, everyone has debts. Some bigger than most, yeah, mine, definitely bigger than most, but Annie wasn't that type of girl. You'll find that people are rarely who they seem. You lose your girl too? Oh, I know a lot about heartbreak. Like how it burns and Guts like gunfire. Your hands get cold. Your throat scratchy like your daddy's old records. You close your eyes and you see her touching his cheek as he picks her up in that fancy new car. And she's wearing that dress that you bought her. I wonder, will he kiss the inside of her wrist? Stop! Stop! I hope Jack crashes that expensive new car of his. I hope he drives it off a cliff. And that can be arranged. Excuse me. All I need is a signature. <laughs> a signature? Blood. Oh, what? Ink's not good enough for you? <laughs> I just need something a little bit more personal, so. No, I don't think I caught your name, sir. You don't recognize me? A church-going pastor's son like you, Sam? Or is it Charlie? You're not going by Clarence again, are you? That name does not suit you. And neither does the honest life, it seems. You're good for one thing and one thing only, sweetheart, and that's running away from the people you owe money to. All your services aren't required, thanks. Why not? Drinker, gambler, card sharp, murderer. So is mine in the end, Sam, and we both know it. So why not get something you want out of the bargain, hmm? It's only fair. Just a signature. Cross my heart.
almost there. Barman! Another drink for my friend, please. Good morning, sunshine. Been waiting for this a long time. Russell. Lost your trail around Louisiana, but I never stopped looking. I used to lie in bed at night, terrified someone was gonna find you before I could. Look, it was self-defense, Russell. Your brother had a knife. You stole his girl. And then you killed him. Now it's my turn. <laughs> Poor boy practically begged me to take his soul. <laughs> he was looking for you in New Orleans of all places. Although I think, in the end, you got the better bargain. You won't have enough time to regret the decision. Most people do. 